gets it under control. It's being forced wide to this near touchline. And he rolls it infield. Good ball to Yara. Yara helps it on towards Lansbury. He gives it back to Yara. Edge of the box, Gonzalo Yara. It's taken away from him, but Magoogan kills it into the top corner. Magoogan ran onto it and smacked it first time into the top corner. And Forrest lead it by three goals to one against ten man Wolves. Magoogan's goal comes in the 90th minute. From Miyakate. Gibbs White will hit it! Goal for Nottingham Forest! They may be deep in trouble, but they're doing everything to find a way out. He kept his eye on it and he drilled it in. Three quarters of the game gone and Forest to level. Again, looking for a second, and they've got a second as well. It's Darius Henderson. Forest lead for the first time on the hour. shot on target so far and that was a very lame one from Menzo Fernandez through the middle here goes Elanga Nottingham Forest take the lead inside three minutes of the second half Chelsea undone poor cold at the start of this second 45 and it's a first goal in 44 club appearances for Anthony Elanga struggling to regroup here. Rogers with a cross, Taylor with a header, and Tiato couldn't keep it out. And Boris lead, Gareth Taylor. Good turn. Oh, what a brilliant ball. The line for Spec game. Rice is going through. He must score. He does score. Rice has surely put Forrest into the semi final of the FA Cup. 73 minutes gone. Lehigh. Ford. Cohen. Deflection. He's done it! Stan Collymore! And Nottingham Forest must feel as though they've broken into the Bank of England. Collymore has stolen a goal from the vaults 
of the Old Trafford defences. Forest back line today. And the Mingas looking for Elanga. And Elanga goal side of Cash. As well the check back, top following support for him. It's Aina coming on to it. Oh, it's a magnificent goal. Nottingham Forest lead inside the opening five minutes. A sensational move. And it's Aina that provides the Forest fire. Lingard helping it away to the left-hand side for Loddy. Loddy charging forward towards the edge of the box. Cuts inside, right to oh! Brilliant! Brilliant oh, goal God. from the Brazilian! It's 1-0 to Forrest and Renan Loddy gets his first goal! Right-footed curler as he cuts inside from 20 yards out and curls it right inside the far post beyond Fraser Forster. Six foot seven he may be, but even full stretch, he could not get anywhere near it. A little piece of Brazilian magic on a November night on Trentside. Through to Linga. This is Yates. Big strike, bounce to Brian Johnson. Pressure here. In towards the penalty area, and it's gone in. And it's Kieran down. And Forest do make their pressure count. And Wolves now at home will have to find a response. In came the corner. Wasn't really a decisive header on it. Find another ball in the opening half hour of the game. Gemmel's onside. Plenty of options here for Forest. Club screaming for the ball. He doesn't have to. Teddy Sheringham is the man who gives it to them. Forward by Worrell to Koyate, who leaves it now for Johnson. Johnson pulls it back, gives right, leaves it right. Yeah! Danilo fires in! Danilo has three in three! And Forrest have a fourth on the night! Lovely little touch from Gibbs White to set up the Brazilian. And Danilo thumps it in in front of the Trent end to give Forrest the goal they so, so badly needed. It's 4-2. They restore their two-goal lead. Eventually, Johnson's ball in. Lovely little flick from Gibbs White. Gibbs White with the free kick. Tantori stepping in, and he comes away with possession and goes for the far corner. It is a fabulous goal from Callum hudson Adoy. Well, they've been threatening to strike back. And Nuno's side have got themselves level just before half-time. So they've been put under pressure and Nottingham Forest have won it back. Now Danilo can charge forward for Nottingham Forest. It's Danilo! Sessegnon caught in possession, Graben onto it, a chance here for 2-0, Lewis Graben finds the net. And those away fans in the corner absolutely delighted. Gifts for Niakate, now Elanga going through the gears, helped to the ground by Isak but the game goes on. Advantage played by Chris Kavanagh and on goes Chris Wood and what a finish that is! He just kept on going and going and going. And the advantage from Chris Kavanagh played a key role in the goal. 
which was so well taken. Just admire the quality of this finish from Chris Wood because that deft touch as Dubravka comes out, that is not an easy finish. Cash has managed to turn past Maitland Niles. It's not away yet, holdings header. And here's Eric Lee. Hi! Oh, that's a remarkable goal! Lehigh has two, Forrest have two. And that second one is truly brilliant. Arsenal made a meal of clearing. Lehigh's onto it. And what a finish that is. It's a goal to remember. away from Grealish, gives it to Lolly. Lolly is 30 yards out, thinking about a shot. Oh, it's in! Oh, what a hit from Joe Lolly! He made three in the first half, and now he's thumped one in from 30 yards. Man who grew up at this ground, watching this team, has fired Forrest back in front. It's 4-3, five minutes into the second half, and it is a thunderbolt from Joe Lolly. running ahead of him, rolls it infield towards McCleary. McCleary now gives it Majewski, who's onside. Despite the fans' protestations, he cuts into the penalty area, beats a man, shoots into the net, beating the goalkeeper at his near post, high into the roof of the net. Randy Majewski scores a very, very good goal. Campbell has got a soft goal for Forrest. 